Hello family, welcome back to the channel, home of the RC community and home of the Patreon that offers the most value out there, okay? When you join the Patreon, all right, you will see our pinned pre-sales up there. And one of those pre-sales are scheduled to uh, launch uh, next week, okay? So if you haven't joined, you will still have enough time to get in on it. And also, if you're interested in the merch, those links will be in the description and in the comments also so i wanted to look at this right here now um i know that i made a video uh informing you guys of how hard say is fighting now say was fighting hard they're still fighting hard when i made those videos we were in the five six to the five five range fluctuating you know in between now just because we see say fluctuating down into the four range right now just remember this. Look at the big picture. Say Tom is still not even supposed to be here at the five zero range. Okay? Based on how hard uh Bitcoin is crashing, say Tom is not supposed to even be here in the five zero range. Now say Tama, for the most part in the morning, have been fluctuating uh between the four nine and the four five range. Okay? And I I'm saying like this, look at Bitcoin. Okay, Bitcoin is now in the 32 range. All right, Bitcoin just not long ago was about to be pushing 40k look how hard they falling bitcoin is falling hard ethereum is falling hard okay when you have bitcoin falling hard like this say tama is not supposed to be here say tama at the, the look at the at the least okay worst case scenario say tama is supposed to be in the mid fours okay to the low fours say tama is supposed to be heading down probably into the three nine range uh, somewhere so say Tama is fighting right now the market look at right, look right here look we have red right here we're down eight percent we were, look we were actually down nine percent now we're up eight what is that telling you that's telling you that the, the volume in the market cap is fighting strong against any of the negativity they're trying to kick they, look say Tama is kicking ass right now in the market we're not supposed to be here at the five zero range not with Bitcoin stinking it up like this look at the big picture don't let nobody come and tell you oh they say Thomas pushing the fours yeah we're pushing the four but we're supposed to have been in the fours okay we're supposed to be in the mid to low fours right now but we're not we're kicking ass in this uh, red market okay Bitcoin we might get a 29,000 uh, Bitcoin okay we might get a, a, a 29k Bitcoin look when Bitcoin is falling hard ethereum is falling hard you know, Bitcoin is falling hard. Uh, Solano, Cardano. Look, Cardano was almost pushing the dollar again, and they're back down six to, uh, 66 uh, cents. Okay, and you all know how I feel about Cardano, okay? Cardano was one of my ground floor uh, investments uh, about five, almost five years ago. Okay, they're not supposed to be here. So I am proud of Saitama. We are ahead of the game right now. And unfortunately, also, uh, if we look here at um, Sheep, Sheep has also lost a position and they fail. I think she will, will uh, rebound, but nobody is. Uh, look, I'm going to say like this. All right. Saitama, how can I put this? Saitama is out of everybody falling. I know that everything is a discount right now, but Saitama is the least okay discounted project right now they're discounted but they're the least discounted project okay outside of the stable coins they're the least discounted project out there even though they're discounted why are they least dis discounted because of this right here look four nine to five zero they're at the four nines now they're the least discounted price because why they are the project out there that's fighting the most. One of the projects out there that is fighting the most. Okay, so um, I also wanted to touch on this right here. I know that a lot of individuals are saying, you know, when will we get back to the all-time highs, okay? Now, a lot of uh, individuals out there, including the Futter, they're spreading a lot of misinformation out there, okay? I want you to understand this, all right? The all-time highs that we see, when we see Saitama uh, at these little all-time highs right here, okay? Oh, or the all-time high, uh, you know, before the Seder Mask event like that, or even the launch, okay? 
you have to know those all-time highs are not sustainable. It's not normal for a project to go back up to those all-time highs. Okay? It's not sustainable. The reason why we believe that because we, we have a lot of individual spread and a lot of misinformation out here. It's not the norm for a project to go back up to the all-time high, a launch uh, all-time high, or a certain event all-time high. Okay? We have to stop setting the bar high for uh, Saitama where we expect them to go. Okay? Lower your bar some, okay? Set that bar at the medium range, okay? Because anything even medium range would be decent uh, for, say, Tama, okay? Will we see those all-time highs? Eventually we will because, as we know, as time passes and those years pass, those uh, cryptos uh, will eventually uh, have to break another milestone, okay? I do not see, say, Tama staying, uh, you know, below, below their all-time high uh, beyond... Uh, like a year or two but i do see them uh breaking that all-time high down the road okay but the thing is this all right we have we can't keep setting the bar high based on what uh somebody else is saying or what somebody else expect okay set it to the medium range okay these all-time highs are not sustainable and the thing is this if you want to look at uh if you if you want to look at what we should expect from all-time high look at the other projects out there Okay, tell me what project out there is staying above their all-time high after launch, okay, or after a, an event, okay? So I wanted to touch on that. I also wanted to touch on uh, what I talked about, about, say, Thomas still fighting. Look, still fluctuating in the four nines. Look, remember this. Remember this, okay? Don't let nobody tell you that, say, Thomas right now is, is uh, stinking it up. We're not supposed to be here. Look at that. Look, look how they're fighting. You just seen it right here. They fluctuating back up into the five zeros. They're fighting. You don't see that? What I tell you, four nine five zero. They're fighting. We were down nine uh, percent. Now it's eight percent. Look at the grain. Look at the volume. Look at the market cap. You got red in between, green in between. It's like they trade in punches. Say Thomas not supposed to be here. Look at Bitcoin. Okay. Bitcoin is crashed. Because Bitcoin is here at 32, say Thomas is supposed to be in like the mid force. They're not supposed to be there. Okay? So if anybody want to fudge say Tama, don't listen to him. Okay, this is a solid investment right here. In my opinion, it's not financial advice, but it's a solid investment right here. How can you go wrong with this? Nobody else is fighting like that. Okay? Not not Ethereum. Like I said, not XRP, not Solana, not Cardano, not Doge. And Doge, we actually might have Doge fall un under uh, 10 cent for the first time in a while. Okay? And also, you got, like I said, you know I, I got a thing for Sheeb. Sheeb is still the best uh, main project out there at the uh, top of the mountaintop. But, you know, um, they've been fighting uh, harder than Sheeb. I think Sheeb is going to rebound, though, because Sheeb has some stuff, uh, some other catalysts coming up. But yeah, I mean, you have to be proud. You have to be proud of say Tama. Okay, so we're going to continue to fluctuate. Um, you know, our buy, our buy price uh, percentage is going to continue to fluctuate. The market cap is, is continuing to kick ass. The volume is also continuing to kick ass. Okay, these greens right here are basically saying, bring it on, market. Bring it on. We got this. Okay, and, and like I said, remember, this is also without what? This is also without a marketing wallet. Okay, and I know that I say they have other financial uh, catalysts um, are coming along, but they're not. A lot of them are not here yet. A lot of those catalysts are waiting on the back burner until a lot of the revenue starts flowing into, uh, uh, say, Thomas, so they can get those other catalysts going. They're doing this out of pocket. This is an out of pocket project fighting like this. You all just seen it. It was at forty nine back up to five. They're going to continue to fight. Okay, so I wanted to make this video. All right, and I will catch you all on the up and up. And remember, okay, every now is history tomorrow. You either have patience in this crypto game or you lose in the end. Just like what? Just like those old Doge investors seven years ago. Don't be those old Doge investors seven years ago. All right, so this is my uh, project and I will catch you all on the up and up. Audi.